Stephanie Foran. I am the head of product and audience performance for Seven Digital Products. So we focus on uh, our flagship product, which is Seven Plus, a video streaming platform. But we've just recently launched uh, sevennews.com.au in April, which is going from strength to strength as well. So uh, it's an exciting time for product development in video streaming. So I started my product journey as a content producer. I was interviewing talent, writing gossip stories, um, going to movies and writing movie reviews, working on recipes on websites, and understanding the value of that content and the audience engagement with that content was what kind of inspired me to take it a step further into technology. I was working at Channel 10 at the time, and we had an incredible team there. I was asking questions and was lucky enough to be um, put onto a project for Offspring, where we built out this bespoke Offspring app for um, audiences and we got to work with the executive producers of the show writing scripts just for this app building out games just for this app it was a really incredible immersive content experience and that's really what kind of turned it for me to get into technology so I moved further into product development when we uh, were building out Tenplay and was working on the connected TV projects there. So we deployed a huge amount of projects with a very lean team and understanding the strength of connected TV back in 2015 was, um, was pretty awesome. So that's gone from strength to strength. Right now, connected TVs is just a huge area for us and we have a huge amount of investment and focus on it. So when I moved to Seven, it was a very big step up for me moving into a management position. We've been working with an incredible team and it's been a really great journey. So what inspires and motivates me at work is the strength of storytelling. So that's storytelling through the actual content in our platforms, but also through the ability to have a conversation with our users through products. And it's about the user experience, but also about the quality of experience. We are in an amazing area where growth of technology excellence has gone from strength to strength. We keep focusing on how we can get our rebuffering rates down and make sure that the experience a user has while they're consuming content is at its very best. So that's what motivates me. Also, what inspires me is working with a brilliant team of people. On a day-to-day -day basis, we take a look at how we went the night before and what we can do to improve for the day ahead and looking at data-driven insights and coming up with just small little pieces that can really improve the product experience and getting them deployed to production in a really fast manner is what inspires me at Seven. So we're working on uh, the Tokyo 2020 Olympics at the moment, which is an incredible privilege to be working on. Uh, we see that as one of the biggest Olympics uh, in our generation, especially because it's in the Australian time zone. So the focus of that is to keep it contextually simple. There's so much content that's going to be available. We need to make it as discoverable as possible to give the best experience to our users. Another thing that uh, we're working on is um, with the streaming awards about to begin even further with Apple and Disney Plus coming in to the market in November, we have identified the need to continue evolving our personalised content experiences. So we've been working on a bit of a cross-department project around recommendations API. So this is utilising all of the data from our users and building affinity maps from genre, TV show, devices, time of day watching and building that in a way that can be utilised in product as well as through our automated marketing and through our uh, targeted advertising as well. So product and technology is currently male dominated but it's really a knowledge dominated area. So my advice to women coming up is to be curious and ask questions and find the smartest people in the room. Never stop being hungry for knowledge because when you become a subject matter expert in something small or something a bit bigger, you're basically the most confident person in the room. So it's all about having knowledge. Knowledge brings the power to have the confidence and knowledge and confidence will get you far.